Hi, I'm Hal Denderant from IEEE Cedar Rapids, and I'd like to tell you about our upcoming conference, ProCon 2008. It's a professional development conference for engineers and technical professionals, and it takes place on April 29th at the Marriott Hotel in Cedar Rapids. It's an all-day conference, two tracks, diversity leadership, and project management. And I'd like to introduce Chris Schulte. Hi, Hal. Hi, Chris. How are you doing? Good. Thank Good. you. So I uh, understand that you attended ProCon last year. Yes, I did, Hal. Right? So I want to ask you a few questions about that. That's fine. Uh, first of all, uh, uh, you were a first-time attendee. Uh, what led you to attend the conference last year? Well, to be real honest, Hal, um, my main objective was to earn project management professional PDUs at a low cost. Okay, and did you get what you expected at the conference? Or what were the highlights for you of the conference? I did, Hal. I greatly enjoyed it. It was a great opportunity to meet other um, local professionals, and one of the things that the conference did for me is it re-energized me in a field that I work in every single day. Okay, very good. Uh, so which session did you attend last year, and what did you think of that session and the speaker? Um, Hal, I attended the project management session, and uh, the speaker focused on team dynamics and leadership techniques, and that's something that's always good to be re-energized on. Um, I gained a great deal of hands-on experience and uh, met some great people. So you mentioned hands-on experience. So do you actually have a chance to participate or do you just listen? Okay, we did. The, the um, presenter offered both individual and team um, hands-on experience. Okay. Well, what do you think is the real value for people like you at a conference like this? I think the, the real value, Hal, is being re-energized in one's profession. We can all become stagnant in our jobs. We do them every day, day in and day out. And I think there's always benefits in learning um, new ideas and bringing new vitality to our everyday careers. So it sounds like uh, ProCon really did help you in your professional life and it's had some lasting consequences, has it? It has, it has, okay. Hal. So, uh, after the conference, you actually joined our planning team, uh, planning ProCon 2008. What led you to do that? Chris? Well, Hal, I, um, I was looking for a local organization to join, and during the lunch hour, I sat with a team of the committee members, and I was really inspired by their enthusiasm, and that was really the reason I joined. Well, we really have had a good team going. This is the 11th year that we've put on ProCon, and many of the people, or at least some of the people, have been there from the beginning. We have a pretty constant team, but we also bring in new people like you, which is very beneficial. Thank so you. let's talk about ProCon. Uh, again, I want to emphasize that it's this April 29th at the Marriott Hotel in Cedar Rapids. It's a two-track session with the general theme, uh, Next Generation Leadership, and the two tracks are Diversity Leadership and uh, project management. Would you tell us a little bit about diversity leadership, who the speaker is? and Certainly, what he's about? certainly. Um, Dr. Uh, Bud Belcher uh, from PRISM International, uh, he plans on talking about building a broad awareness of diversity and expanding perspectives. Um, he's um, also talking about working across cultures and modeling uh, behaviors and creating um, inclusive workplaces. Okay. And then our other main speaker is Cinda Vokley. She's from projectconnections.com and is also president of Emprend Incorporated. And she is, will be speaking about the business savvy project manager and becoming great project managers. So all of these sessions are morning and afternoon sessions. And we have the two speakers, morning and afternoon. And it is possible to switch sessions if that's what you want to do. That's right. And don't forget, how the great lunch uh, speaker we have planned, uh, Janet Wilhelm. She's uh, this year's director of the Freedom Festival, and she'll be talking about how planning an event like that takes a lot of project management methodology. So there is some emphasis on project management, and project management is something that everybody really needs to know how to do in the technical and professional and engineering environment. And I might mention that that this conference is an all-day conference and the cost is really quite low, not only because uh, it's a local conference and most attendees will be from this area, but the cost, pre-registration cost is only $90 and there's a discount for IEEE members of $15, so $90 for an all-day conference is a pretty good price. That's a pre-registration price. By April 15th, you have to be in on that. 
But even if it's after April 15th that you sign up, the cost is only $15 more. So the maximum cost is $105, which is pretty much of a steal, I think. Right. And also, if you are a student um, or retired or unemployed, uh, your cost is only $30 to, to attend the all-day event. That's right. And we do have a website. And the website has all of the information that you could possibly want to know about uh, ProCon. And you can also register on the website. Or if you prefer, you can download the flyer and, and there's a registration, paper registration you can send in. And that's ProCon2008.org for the website. And uh, we really want to thank our sponsors. There's Rockwell Collins, Alliant Energy and Informatics, and also from Pearson, Intermec, and Fiserv Insurance Fiserv, Solutions. Fiserv, new this year. So we certainly want to invite you to come to ProCon 2008. It's April 29th at the Marriott. Two tracks, low cost, project management, and diversity leadership. Something that will be good for you in your professional life and also very enjoyable in your personal life. So please come and join us. Hope to see you there. <laughs> <laughs>